Hi, humans. Pokemon. I'm gonna open this Pokemon thing. Let's see what's inside. I already took the plastic off, but here we go. Check out these. It's got a shiny Pikachu. It's shiny. And then a, well, the card is shiny. It's not a shiny. But the, and then a, th these two. And the super cute little Mew thing. Mew flipping card. Okay. Go. First uh, thing. Okay, let's see. We've got another uh, lab toys. Then a catcher. Goler. Energy, Golith, Voltorb, and maybe I'll sort like the, I'll put the shinies, the shiny ones aside, like the shiny cards. Then a Cor, Cor, no. This is uh, like one of the starters from Sun and Moon, which is cool. And then a Voltorb. This one's got a shiny background, which is fun. And look at this really cool uh, cover thing. And this one. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Okay, hey, we've got a Scrappy and um, and we've got uh, some energy cards. We've got uh, this um, Keldo, which has got a really great um, two water type energies and you can, um, this attack does 20 more damage for each of your opponent's benched Pokemon and it also for uh, regular or water type energy, bail out, put a water type Pokemon from your discard pile into your hands. This is definitely going in my deck. Then uh, um, another Scrappy. This one also has a pretty shiny background. An Ekans, which is cool. Uh, not the strongest, but you know, you need to be able to ev do the evolution thing. So, and then uh, Purloin. Then this one says flip two coins, this attack does. 20 damage for each of the heads. And then I've got uh, a, a Minun, which is cool. And then I can, with one regular energy, I can draw a card or a spark. This attack does 20 damage to one of your opponent's benched Pokemon, which is cool. I hope I get the, um, I hope I get its cute little buddy because then these would make a good pair. Put that aside here for that purpose. I will be right back. I was making Veterans Day cookies. Thank you to all veterans for serving and making the sacrifices that you made. Maybe not being... I wonder if they play Pokemon cards, like, while deployed. I don't know. Another one. Here's one with the super cute um, Mew. Uh, foil thing. See what we got here. Ooh, cool, an Arbok with uh, ability. As long as this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, your opponent's active Pokemon attacks do 30 less damage before applying weakness and resistance. Cool. Then it has a good um, Venomous Fang move, so that can be paired with the Ekans I've got. Nice. Um, and then, uh, ah, in Incineroar, which can go with this one, I would just need the, um, the Litten to go with this. And I'm 
might have a Litten with my other Pokemon cards. I'd have to check that. I don't know off the top of my head. Then uh, Sophocles Trainer, Fire-type Energy. Ooh, and a, a, a Keldo. Another Keldo, which is great because um, it's got that uh, benched Pokemon boost cool thing. And it's shiny, and then a Qualfish, Scraggly. Another Torcat, but it's uh, still need a Litten. But it's still good to have more than one of these. Um, yes, a Pulse. So now I have a Pulse and, um, <clears throat> uh, and a Minun, so I can, with, if these two are together, if Minun is in your bench, this attack does 50 more damage. So it uh, only requires, so long as the, it, the, um, the Minun is in my bench, I can do 50 damage with a, uh, it's only got 70 HP, but it only requires one electric type energy. So that's a pretty good um, combo there, in my opinion. Then I've got um, a Buzzel, and then uh, another, uh, and I have a Scraffy. So, wow, cool. These can go together. There's an evolution there. Pretty cool. Then the energy card. Of course, the online ones. Okay, I've got two more to go. Okay, so it looks like I've got a uh, Croconaw, ah, which is pretty good. I like those. It's um, I don't have. I would have to check if I have the uh, other evolution forms. Pokemon Breeder card: draw two cards and heal twenty damage from your active Pokemon. If you have no cards in your deck, you cannot play this card. Then a Pikachu, which is good because it's always good to have. If if I'm gonna play a Raichu, it's always good to have lots of the starting ones. Another Ekans. Ooh, beautiful. Not the strongest, but if you have the um, evolution, it can be pretty good. But this is a beautiful card. Um, and um, another one of these. This is crazy. This is awesome. I got a Raichu GX with 210 HP. And then it's got uh, a some pretty good moves. I can because you can do one GX move per game, and uh, this one is 120 damage. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed, and but the other move isn't the best because it does 30 damage to itself. But if you're trying to wipe out someone's strong Pokemon, then it might be worth it. And then um, powerful spark. The, the this attack does 20 more damage times the amount of energy attached to your Pokemon. So that one's also a pretty good one. And it's shiny and it's a full art. This is, I, I'd have to look up how much this one's actually worth. Beautiful. And then, nice, an energy card. And this, um, Carvinai, Car Carnivine, nice card too. And then uh, switch your active Pokemon with one of your benched Pokemon. Pretty good if you have a powerful Pokemon that got uh, put into your bench. Then draw three cards. It's pretty good. And then I have one more. And then it looks like there's some pretty cool stuff underneath here. Like, I'll show you in just a minute. And look, this is a, I think it's got Genesect on this, which is pretty cool. Whoa, this is really pretty. It's got a, it's got a, um, first evolution of the, uh, Shaman. Shaman. There we go. It goes in the shiny pile. Have I been remembering to set aside the shinies? Not all of them. I'm bad at this, but I'm having fun. Okay. All right, keep that there because it's special. And then, uh, uh another... Uh, float Zell. This one is shiny though, and I think that might. Let me check something. Yeah, there we go. Now I have the full evolution of that one, so that's cool. And then another of the uh, Corkinaw, another uh, Scraggy, another Torcat. Ooh, another Pulse. That's cool. Another uh, Buzel. Got a 
plant type energy. Ooh, an Ultra Ball. Discard two cards from your hand. If you do, search your deck for Pokemon, reveal it, and put it into your hand, then shuffle into your deck. This is pretty good. Um, the other trainer is a little bit better, but still pretty cool. And then Lily, draw cards until you have six cards in your hand. If if it's your first turn, draw cards until you have eight cards in your hand. Cool. Then draw two cards and heal 20 damage. So another one of these ones. Pretty cool. So uh, then it's got these nice pencils. Super cool. Probably won't actually use these pencils because they're so cute. I'll put them on display in my room. And then it's got these really nice um, mini posters, it looks like. One's got the Pikachu and the, um, you actually, these are stickers. Huh. Although they're so beautiful on this, I'll probably use them as mini posters. And then they've got, um, they've got the Mewtwo, uh, Genesect, and, oh my goodness, I'm blanking. Guys, remind me what this one is. I know what it is. It's the shiny version. It's super cool. It's fun. Refeeding. DDD. And then, ooh, this is cool. Then it's got this notepad of amazingness. Notepad which is super cool and pretty. It's got the two from the box. And then a um, Rayquaza? Mega Rayquaza. Uh, shiny Mega Rayquaza, is that right? That's, that, I think that's right. And then this awesome deck displayer thing that's got the Pokemon that's featured on this. I can take out this last plastic. I'll show you this really beautiful lunchbox. Then I'll put everything in. Super cool. Yeah, the so here again are the like the um here I'll flip it. And then do yeah. Here's the um, cards that I got that have the metallic background. Oh, this, yeah. The one I'm most excited about is this one. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a GX. I can use it with some of my Pikachus. This one, this one, this one's super fun. I think I got uh, two of this one and this one's really great because uh, you can use it by itself and it's got a pretty strong moves. It's, you know, 20 plus, but um, for each one of your opponent's uh, benched Pokemon, so that's pretty good if you use it at the right time. Then this super, super cute Pikachu. Then I've got three different arts for this, look, the, um, which is a lot of fun. Anyway, this is what I've got. Bye-bye, humans. Have a beautiful day.